Missouri Outline, this week's development news. Hi, I'm Amy Susan, Communications Director for the Missouri Department of Economic Development. Missouri added two more companies to its ever-growing list of businesses choosing to expand in the Show Me State last week. Global manufacturer SKF announced plans to construct a new state-of-the-art manufacturing facility in St. Louis County, a $34.2 million capital investment that will create 73 new jobs and retain 388 jobs. And the state's transportation and logistics industry also grew, with XPO Logistics announcement to open a new office in Kansas City, a $1.2 million capital investment that will create 125 new jobs. In this week's tech news, the city of Cape Girardeau was recently selected as the newest location for One Million Cups, a weekly event that offers local entrepreneurs the opportunity to pitch their startup ideas. Created by Kansas City-based Coffin Foundation, One Million Cups has now grown to more than 60 cities since launching in 2012. Missouri's Comprehensive State Energy Plan is wrapping up its statewide public meeting tour this week. You can join the conversation still about Missouri's energy future at one of its last two meetings, this afternoon in Sykeston or on Thursday afternoon in Kirksville. Visit energy.mo.gov for more details. And Governor Nixon announced last week that Small Business Relief Program has surpassed $200,000 in zero-interest loans to small businesses affected by recent events in the Ferguson area. To date, the Collaborative Loan Program has assisted 17 small businesses in the area. For the full news coverage, visit the Missouri Outline webpage. And that's what's going on in this week's development news.